Spare, the intimate and revealing memoir by Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, provides readers with a candid look at the life of one of the world's most scrutinized members of the British royal family. Born as the second son of Prince Charles and Princess Diana, Harry was immediately cast into a role he never chose, with the media dub his The Spare to his brother, the heir, Prince William. In the memoir, Harry delves into his early memories, shaped by the glare of public attention and the complex dynamics within the British royal household. He reflects on his bond with his mother, Princess Diana, whose death in a car accident in 1997 left a profound impact on his life. Harry describes his and William's grief, as well as the challenges of mourning under the intense scrutiny of the public eye. The memoir follows Harry through his years of struggling to find his place within the royal family and a life of purpose and meaning. He discusses his time at Eton and his gap year adventures, where he found a sense of freedom and normalcy away from his royal duties. Harry's decision to join the British Army is portrayed as a turning point, granting him anonymity and camaraderie among his fellow soldiers. His two tours of Afghanistan are described with raw honesty as he experienced the realities of conflict and formed deep bonds with his comrades in arms. Throughout Spare, Prince Harry is open about the challenges he faced with his mental health, intensified by the constant media intrusion into his personal life. He talks about the difficulty in defining his role in the public eye, often feeling overshadowed by his brother, Prince William. This inner turmoil was accompanied by his high-profile relationships, and the paparazzi's obsession with his love life, leading Harry to develop a deep mistrust of the media. Harry's relationship with Meghan Markle and their subsequent marriage is a focal point of the book. He describes their instant connection, the media frenzy that ensued, and the racism and harassment that Meghan faced, which brought back haunting memories of his mother's struggles. Harry expresses his disappointment with the way the royal family and its advisors managed or failed to manage the situation, further straining his relationship with the institution. As he recounts the developments that led to their decision to step back from royal duties, a move now known as Megxit, Harry reveals the complex negotiations and tensions with the royal family. He opens up about the hurt and betrayal he felt as they sought independence and a life away from the unrelenting pressures of their roles. Harry provides insights into the couple's move to North America and their ongoing work to establish a life of service outside the traditional royal framework. Throughout the book, Prince Harry shares personal anecdotes and reflections, painting a picture of his struggles, joys, and search for authenticity. He discusses the birth of his children, the joy they brought him, and his desire to protect his family, which remains at the forefront of his actions and decisions. He also shares his ongoing efforts to come to terms with his past, including seeking therapy and facing his unresolved anger and sadness over his mother's death. Spare is at once a critique of the institutional pressures and media environment that shaped Harry's experiences and a testament to his resilience and commitment to forging his own path. He grapples with the balance between his love for his family and the constraints of their expectations, all while being a husband and father determined to break the cycles of media exploitation and emotional suppression. With profound vulnerability, Harry provides readers with an unprecedented perspective on his life, from the privileges and burdens of royalty to the universal human desires for understanding, belonging, and happiness. He is critical of the royal institution and certain family members, yet he also expresses his enduring love for his grandmother, Queen Elizabeth VI, and the hope for reconciliation and understanding. Spare is not only a memoir, but a plea for empathy and a call for change in how the media and public interact with those in the spotlight, particularly those who never chose that life for themselves. Through the pages of this book, Prince Harry invites the world to view him not as a prince, but as a person, a husband, a father, and a man still on his quest for peace and purpose. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.